Double Trouble, story by Dandy Daly McCall, pictures by Claudia Wolf. Jen loved to ride Bob the horse. Her friend Dave loved to ride Lily. Follow me, Jen called. Look out, Dave shouted. But it was too late. The horses ran right into Mrs. Gray's flower bed. <coughs> Jen looked around for Mrs. Gray. Let's get out of here, said Dave. Jen knew she should tell Mrs. Gray what they did to her flowers, but maybe she could do it later. Jen put Bab back in his pen. Then Jen went home. Poor Mrs. Gray, Mom said. They were eating dinner. What? Jen asked. Someone tore up her flowers, Dad said. She's really angry. Jen didn't say anything. She took a bite of bread, but it didn't go down well. Jen didn't sleep well that night. Alone, she said her prayers. Dear God, I didn't mean to hurt the flowers, and it was such a little thing, but she still felt bad inside. Why is Bob walking funny? Jen asked Mrs. Gray the next day. Poor Bob was limping. Maybe Bob is stiff like me, said Mrs. Gray. Keep an eye on him today. Let's see if he gets better. Jen watched Bob all day. Bob didn't get better. Your hoof must be sore, Jen said. I'll go tell Mrs. Gray. Maybe she can help. Jen found Mrs. Gray working in her flower bed. That made Jen feel even worse. She knew she should tell Mrs. Gray about hurting the flowers. But it was such a little thing. How's our Bob? asked Mrs. Gray. He still walks funny, Jen said. Mrs. Gray said, I'll call the vet. Mrs. Gray and Jen waited for the vet. Jen felt worse and worse. Jen had to tell about the flowers. Mrs. Gray, Jen began. Here comes the vet now, Mrs. Gray said. Let me see Bab walk, said the vet. Jen led Bab around the pen. Poor Bob has a limp, the vet said. The vet picked up Bob's big hoof. Easy, big Bob, said the vet. <laughs> she poked around on the hoof. Well, what do we have here, asked the vet. Jen moved in to see Bob's hoof. What did you find? Jen asked. I found this, said the vet. She dug out a tiny rock. Here's what was wrong with Bob, the vet said. No way, Jen said. That little rock hurt Big Bob? The rock is little, said the vet, but it felt pretty big to Bob. Little things can make big sores. They become big problems. That rock had to come out, Jen. Look at Bob, said Mrs. Gray. That horse is walking fine now. <coughs> Bob feels good again, Jen said. Jen wanted to feel good again, too, but now it felt very big. Mrs. Gray, Jen said, I rode Bob through your flowers. I'm really sorry. Jen helped Mrs. Gray plant new flowers. They dug in the dirt all day. My hands and knees hurt, Jen said, but it's okay. Jen smiled over at Bob and said, Bob and I are fine. We don't hurt inside anymore. <laughs> <laughs>